Hello, I'm Thaler Picar, and much of my work is focused on helping smart leaders and their organizations find and develop stories that they can share with external audiences. I'd like to share with you now two examples of how I helped organizations share their stories. It's my goal that you can use these tools to develop clarity in your own communication. We all want to be heroes. It's our natural inclination to align ourselves with solutions rather than to associate with problems. A smart organization helps their customer be the hero in their stories. It's not you or your organization or your salespeople or your product that's the hero of an effective and persuasive story. Rather, it's your client who's the hero for choosing to work with you, or it's your customer who's the hero for choosing to buy your product, and it's your donor who's heroic for giving to your organization and helping to solve some pressing societal problem. A smart organization shares stories to which their listeners can relate to the protagonists and feel heroic in their own right. For example, I recently helped North America's largest provider of emergency response software and hardware to share a story about a county emergency services director. This county director took a great professional risk and went before her county board of supervisors to advocate for the purchase of a state-of-the-art piece of technology that would um, bring great value to the residents of her community and did ultimately help save lives. It was my client's initial inclination to share the story of a battered woman who was able to be saved because she was able to text 911 from the closet in which she was hiding using this new technology. It's certainly a compelling story. The buyers of the product, however, can really relate to the professional risk that the community services director took and how that director uh, was a hero in fighting to uh, secure and bring this technology to her community. Similarly, uh, America's largest creator of affordable housing has been sharing the stories of the formerly homeless and uh, homeless men and battered women who are now living happily and safely in housing that the organization has helped to create. These are compelling stories, too, about transformed lives. The wealthy donors and the uh, bank and real estate tycoons from whom the organization is wishing to solicit support can relate better, however, to the story of the community developers who helped develop the housing in the first place. These community developers saw the need to bring affordable and safe housing into their communities, and they were able to do so because of the support of the organization. Think about the stories that you're sharing. How can you shift your story so that your listener can picture him or herself as the hero? How can you help your listener associate with heroic solutions?